One of the problems that some students find when they're first using InDesign is that they haven't properly set up their master pages. So they're going through and setting up their document and there's certain elements that they want to have showing up on each page such as this header, this yellow header with the volume information and this footer. Um, and it's nice to have it be able to repeat automatically on every page so that you don't have to copy and paste. Because normally what you would do is, um, let's say you were using another software program, you would have to draw all these elements, for example, this yellow box and this blue gradient, and then you would select these items and then copy and paste them onto the second page or if I were to create another page um, oops that didn't copy properly let me try that again um, I copied it but now I also have to place it in exactly the right spot so a much easier way of doing this is to create a master page um, so under the pages tab right here and if you don't see it you can go to window and then select pages you'll see that you have master pages one is none I usually let's see I usually leave that one blank so that I can um, if I don't want to have any formatting on a particular page I can just drag this to that page um, but on my first master page you can see that there's nothing here. There are the, the guides that have been set up in the document settings, but nothing else. So if I wanted certain consistent elements, such as these colored boxes, um, I'm going to select those, copy them. Hopefully it will copy properly this time. Um, I can place it where I want and then now on my new page that's blank I have an A right here it's telling me that the A master has been applied so anything that I put on this A master is going to show up on pages with that if I don't want any um, formatting applied I can just drag this none to this page and now when I go to page two, again, you can see it's completely blank. Um, so that's a great way to be able to repeat certain elements on your pages. And if you notice that you you think you've set up your master and then you go through your pages and you see that it's not actually repeating on every page that you've applied the master, first check and see that you have the letter of the master page you set up on each page that you would like it on and then if that's the case and it's still not repeating then you probably didn't set up the master page the way you wanted it to.